Hello to all my fellow space worthy adventurers. If you're like me, then No Man's Sky is something you've been waiting for for the longest time. Me, probably about two years. I don't know. It's been about probably two years since I since I found out that they were making uh, this awesome ass game. I'm not sure how long it's been in the works, but probably about two years now. Well, year and a half maybe. Uh, but, but that's beside the point. If, if you've been waiting for this game, just like me, then it's finally here. It came out PS4 two days ago, I believe. Uh, today's August 12th. We've now got it for PC. I've just installed it. But if you're like me, you might be encountering this error. So you click it, you launch it, you're getting ready to play the game, boom. You get stuck with an error. Error, unable to initialize OpenGL window. Your, pro your, your heart's probably a little bit broken. Mine was. And it took me a little bit to figure out what to do because this game's out just out so and I mean not even not many people have posted a video so I'm just gonna I'm gonna make this quick video to show you how to how to fix this problem it's a real simple step to um, what you're gonna need you're you're gonna need some kind of uh, notepad editor I suggest notepad plus um, plus I'll I'll put a, I'll put a link down in the description just so you guys can have an easy download link um, yeah but that's pretty much all you need uh, so what you want to, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to open up your files. Um, I'll show you how to get to it. So you open up your files. You go to your yours. If you haven't changed, I'll go to my uh, PC. So y if you haven't changed, if you haven't uh, moved your Steam folder um, to any other place, if you just have it default, it's gonna be here in your C drive. Mine is not. Mine's over here in my G, G drive. So everything I say so everything from here on out it's gonna be the same so mine's G but yours is probably gonna be C so from here on out it's gonna be the same so you wanna go to your program files uh, Steam scroll down a little bit you're gonna find Steam apps you're gonna go to common and you wanna scroll down until you find No Man's Sky you wanna go to binaries settings and then you're gonna have three files here uh, not even gonna worry about that one. TK game settings. Don't worry about that one either. TK graphics settings. Dot mxml. That's what you're gonna need to uh, use. So you're gonna right click on it. And I hope you, you should have downloaded Notepad plus plus by now if you didn't already have it. So you're gonna right click on it. You're gonna hit edit with Notepad plus plus. You're gonna open it up. You're gonna have these two lines right here is what you're what you're worried about. For me, it defaulted. I'm not sure if it defaults for everybody this way, but for me, it definitely defaulted at 1920 by 1080. Um, so what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna. The reason this is happening is it's not. That's not your current setting. So you're gonna have to figure out what your current setting is. I'll show you how to do that as well. So you're gonna minimize this. You're gonna right click anywhere on your desktop. I have a Nvidia GTX 980, I believe. 970 maybe I'm not sure, uh, but you can if you have Nvidia you can open it that way. And Nvidia takes forever to launch for me, but uh, easiest way to do it you want to right click anywhere on your desktop, display settings. This is Windows 10 by the way. You want to go scroll down, advanced setting or display settings, and you're gonna find your display right here. I've got three monitors. This is my main one, so that's what I'm focused on. And mine is 1768 by 992. It's a TV, so it's a, it's a that's why it's a weird settings. Um, but yeah, so that's what you want. It's what you're gonna want to replace it with 1768 by 992 yours is gonna be different more than likely unless you have the same exact dimensions as my TV uh, or my monitor but uh, that's what I need to change mine to so we'll go back to here 1920 will now become 1768 and 1080 will become 992 I'm gonna save that we can close out of this now close out of that you can close out of everything basically uh, let's go back to no man's sky and let's see if it works and there you have it it launches no errors whatsoever if this fix worked for you please uh, give it a like comment if it didn't or if you have if you have some issues I'll try to I'll try to help out any way I can uh, this is the only error that I've encountered so yeah if you 